Hi, and welcome. This is Dr. Lenore Murciano Luna. And I wanted to come on today because as we approach this summer solstice, this beautiful um, point in time that we're moving towards, um, I want to share with you the five universal mothers in celebration of our summer solstice. And the five universal mothers are really the archetypes, it's the embodiment of the divine that um, most of us have been disconnected from the mother and um, from the earth, from our own essence and from our own embodiment of that. And so I'd like to read to you um, from The Birth of the Conscious Feminine, my book, and actually the revised um, copy is coming out now in August. So stay tuned for more of that um, in another video. But I wanted to read a little bit about, um, share with you a poem, and then talk just briefly about the five embodiments, the five universal mothers, and how we can, at this time, really allow ourselves to be nurtured, to be fed by um, the mother energy and from the feminine. Um, we're all really needing this feminine energy, not just within ourselves, within the earth. And so this is one way that we can honor that. Embodiment of the five elements of the feminine. Earth relates to our physical body and roots us deep with the gravity of love. Air relates to our mental body as it invigorates us with creative thoughts. Water relates to emotional body as it expresses our being. Fire relates to our soul body as it invigorates our life essence. And ether relates to our consciousness and space as it contains us in that reality of love. And so with each of the universal mothers, with each of these elements, of course they're outside of us, but they're also within us. You know, the earth, we feel it in our bones and we feel it in our structure. And the water, of course, we feel it outside of us in the oceans, but also, inside of us because we're about 70% water and we feel it in our fluids and in our blood and it carries the history in our body. And the fire is the aspect of that spark within us, that spark, that life force that ignites all of the energy and all of the processes in our body. The air element, of course, is the the air that we breathe, it's the oxygen. And each one of these has a particular um, archetype um, associated, which I'll tell you in a minute. But the um, we have the air and we have the ether, which is the substance of consciousness, really, that we're, that we're swimming in, right? And that we experience as love, that consciousness of the divine. So the universal mothers um, each have not just an outer representation, but also an inner representation. And the earth mother is of course the earth mother, as we know her, the earth with all of the other elements um, alongside, right, that she provides. And the ocean mother is the ocean mother of love, of love that we find ourselves literally swimming in this ocean of love. And we have the air, which we breathe and connects us to that cosmic womb um, that's breathing us at all times. And each one of these also has a particular breath, which um, I'll be actually, we'll be going into these all in our, um, Feminine Path, the, the new app that I will be launching later on um, this summer. So I'm very excited about that. And the Universal Mother is to really go outside 
and connect with all of these elements, but then also realize that we, as an embodied um, human being in our physical bodies carry all of these elements and the mother, the love, the nurturing is right there. It's right here. It's like we're not separate. We are all of these elements. We are the earth, the water, the air, the fire, and the ether, which is a space in between. So this weekend, as the summer solstice approaches, um, let yourself go and connect with nature, but realizing that you are nature, that our physical bodies are nature, and um, that there is no separation. And let yourself feel held and contained and fed, and also acknowledging the sacredness in our bodies. And this is, this is the body that we can actually feel our spirits. We can't feel um, our spiritual dimension unless we're in a body, at least at this plane, right? So thank you and um, wishing you all a very beautiful uh, summer solstice. Also, I will be speaking on Sunday in the um, First World uh, Global Day of the Divine Feminine. I'm an invited guest speaker, which I'm very excited about. That will be at 9, I believe it's 9.30 Eastern time, and I'll put some details um, below. And um, also, all of this information will be in the Feminine Path app. Which will, which is really a um, a spiritual journey to heal and awaken to the feminine, specifically for women, which walks us through not just the universal mothers, but the sacred initiations and a few other, and a few other um, the superpowers, the feminine superpowers, and a few other things that are really just um, created as a feminine path for women for women, an embodied path where we can feel the love and also heal the trauma that we've been through and, and the wounds. So thank you again, many, many blessings and peace.